But it doesn't matter what your wife's telling you anyway. You ain't listening. Blokes never listen. They never fucking listen. You ever do that thing when your wife's talking to you? You just fuck off for a while. <laughs> just zone out someplace else. Your wife would be right in front of you and she'd go, oh, listen, listen, I was up the ice street the other day and I saw what's her name. You know what's her name? She's got that really sort of boring voice. Well, she said to me, right. <laughs> You know, you're just staring back at her. In your mind, you're going, ah, I'll, I'll take the dog out. I ain't got a dog, but fuck it, I'll take it out. I'll have a dump, definitely need a dump. <laughs> then I'll watch the football, yeah, dump football, yeah. Hold on, she's coming back, she's coming back. So I thought next Thursday, what do you reckon? Yeah, dump first, love, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Blokes don't listen. That's why we never remember anything. She does, though, she fucking remembers everything. You ever had that in the middle of an argument? Yeah. When? You ever had one of them? Your wife does it to you. Go on then, you tell me. When? Well, I don't fucking know offhand. <laughs> you try that, doing that to a woman. Go on then, you tell me. When? They can name you times, dates, your DNA, what the fucking weather was like that day. <laughs> your wife... Has your wife ever just walked up to you just randomly and gone like that? What did I ask you to do this morning? Well, if you don't know love, we're fucked. <laughs> Did it? Women give us no incentive to remember. They answer their own questions. You ever been sat in a room and your wife just walks in and she goes, ah, what was the name of that woman we saw on holiday? What was her name? And you're sat there going, uh, 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 uh. Maureen, thanks. <laughs> OK, good to be of assistance. <laughs> Sometimes they don't even give us a clue. They just walk in a room and go, well, forget it. <laughs> That's the best one. <laughs> you ever been sat in a room and your wife just walks in, chatting? Just fucking chatting. You've been sat in a room, they walk in, they go, was it in here? Was it in here? Was it in here? Was it upstairs? Was it upstairs? It's the kitchen. Fuck it, I'll have a look in the kitchen. <laughs> in that fucking conversation, then. <laughs> I love those pointless arguments, you know, when your wife goes, like, everything I say you disagree with, you go, no, I don't. <laughs> 24 years of marriage, I forgot my anniversary. Fuck, I didn't mean it. I didn't, you know, it slipped me mind. <laughs> Never forget your wife's anniversary. I didn't realise how important it was to women. You know, you think you're having a nice day. You're on your way home, skipping, la, la, la. La, 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 la. You walk into your house, walk into your kitchen, there's your wife at the kitchen sink doing her shit impression of a stuck DVD. <laughs> Welcome to What the Fuck Have I Done? <laughs> and then you ask, what's the matter, love? Well, an apology might be nice. Or I'm sorry, too late now. And then it comes, the envelope. She gives you an envelope. It's not a normal looking envelope. It's got flowers all around it. Fuck, I remember. You see her mouth going to slow motion. <laughs> you forgot I know about so. <laughs> you fuck now. You, could have, you might as well just walk outside, dig a hole, stand in it, shoot yourself, gather the earth back over you. You could have got a cheap bunch of flowers in the garage on the way home, but now you're in one of those expensive florists going, give me fucking everything. <laughs> They should have like a fucked up section in there, you know, when you're paying for them, the woman can hit you in the face of the flowers. You fucked up. <laughs> Go and stand in the window. <laughs> you know, you say to a woman, I forgot my anniversary, they go, oh. <laughs> you say it to a bloke, they go, <laughs> <laughs> Even if you do remember and you want to surprise her, you fuck, because women hate not knowing what's going on. They do that big number on you, that big suspicious number. They confront you, they go, ah, what's going on here? What's going on? You're whispering on the phone, you're creeping in and out of the house. What's fucking going on here? Well, I was going to surprise you. Oh, are you fluent it now? <laughs> you know why women never forget? I'll tell you why they never forget, because they got that <laughs> fucking calendar hanging in the kitchen. <laughs> They just keep pointing at it, going like, no, I told you, it's on the calendar. <laughs> and if it's on her calendar, you're fucking doing it. For it is written. <laughs> Who invented 
read the calendar. The Romans, do you think Julius Caesar had the same problem? Tomorrow I shall invade Britain. No, Jules, we're going to have my mums, look. <laughs> and she has a gun at me for forgetting my wife. Sometimes she forgets she's even married. I don't get home much, but when I am, I'll be standing in their kitchen. And she, she'll walk in and she'll go, Oh, you're fighting a fucking life out. <laughs> well, who was you expecting? Someone else? <laughs> you must remember me, I was at our fucking wedding. I wouldn't mind, but a couple of days later, she does it again. She'll walk in and go, oh, you're front of bloody... Not this again. Look around them and all the photos. <laughs> 24 years of marriage. What, you forgot you had a husband? You've been creeping around the house for years with the kids going, who's that bloke? <laughs> what the fuck is that? <laughs> you know, sees a picture of me on the wall. Fuck, that's him! <laughs> <laughs> Mind you, she even freaks out when I'm not in the room. If I'm not in the room, she'll walk in and go, where the fuck's he gone? <laughs> I'll be at home, my mobile starts ringing. Where are you? I'm upstairs. What are you doing upstairs? My mobile was ringing. <laughs> Blokes don't do any of that. You walk in the room, your wife's not there, you just ask the kids, where's your mum? My daughter always says the same thing. I don't know, Dad, I'm here with you. You ever done that? You've gone out of the house, you, your wife's gone out of the house, you walk into the house and you go, are you back yet? What if she's not? What the fuck are you open to hear? A voice from the high street. No, I'm still in millets. 